Welcome to the Choose Joy Podcast. I'm Tisa, your host, praying a simple prayer for our complex world. And I just simply love the idea of being unbothered because we decide if and how the circumstances we face impact us because our faith assures us that God is in control. And because our Father never fails, we can remain unbothered by rude and irritating people, those who mean ill towards us and take our kindness for weakness, those situations that seem as if they will never end. It is my prayer for us all that we continue to cast the cares of this life onto the broad shoulders of our loving Father, that we never lose the conviction that our God is able. Pray this prayer with me. Lord God, we know you to be faithful and true. You promise never to leave us or forsake us, and your word tells us to cast our cares onto you because you care for us. So we will go about this day unbothered by any challenges we face. Every relationship, be it with our children, our spouse, friends, and co-workers, we know that you are working it out for our good. We will hand over our troubles at work, concerns that we can't work out, but God, you surely can. And we will let go of the things that cause us stress, knowing that you would have for us only peace and joy. Any illness, injury, and disease, none of this will cause us to worry because we know you to be a healer. So teach us today to number our days that we may get a heart of wisdom. God, we celebrate today your mercy and your grace. It's in the mighty and matchless name of Jesus that we pray. Amen. Thank you so much for praying with me here today at Choose Joy with Tisa. This prayer was called Unbothered, a prayer to let go of the small things. And the key verse that I pulled for us today comes from Hebrews, the 11th chapter and verse number one. And it's familiar to us all that says, now faith is the assurance of things hoped for, the conviction of things not seen. And I purposely chose this translation because it uses the word conviction, because I want us all to be certain in our mind and in our hearts that God is able to do even the impossible. However you found this prayer today, I hope you will subscribe before you go and share it with a friend so they too can be encouraged to let go of the small things. It's okay to be unbothered. Until next time, I pray that you choose joy.